Hello friends, are you keeping busy? When I was a little boy, my dad knew how to keep me busy and teach me about tools and, and taking care of them. Um, he'd give me a, a piece of wood, a plank, and he'd grab a hammer and he said, here Danny, use this hammer and what I'd like you to do is I've got a bucket of bent nails here and I'd like you to straighten these nails. Just put it on the board and give it a few whacks until you make that nail usable again. See, both my parents grew up during the Depression and they didn't throw anything away that might have another use. So when Great Camp Sagamore asked me if I'd write a song about their uh, the, one of the barns in the workers' complex, it took me back to working in the barn with my dad. Every job would start in the barn as we sketched out the project at the workbench and then gather our tools and at the end of the day bring it back and, and clean up. So uh, that's how this song Big Beams came about. Driving down a back road, chew mail pouch caught my eye. Faded paint on the side of a barn, buried in weeds grown high. Buildings going up all over, but there's no more need for this one. That weather it would has a tale to tell, but there's no one round here to listen to those big beams hand hewn out of hemlock, olden tractors, plows, and livestock for the women and men who work so hard. Just like big beans, ones you can depend on, bear the load and send on the courage and the strength to be big beans. It reminded me of back home and the three barns side by side, the horse and the sheep and the hay barn, built with muscle and pride. When I worked for my dad in the summer, those dog days seemed so long And I wondered what kept him going What made my father so strong Just like big beans Hand hewn out of hemlock Holding tractors, plows, and livestock For the women and men who work so hard Just like big beans Ones you can depend on to bear the load and send on the courage and the strength to be big beams. When we sat in the horse barn doorway, Dad told me stories and dreams, and that weathered man had a tale to tell, he'd been working since he was sixteen. But now we've both grown older, he's not as strong as he used to be. He said, where did all my strength go? I told him, you gave it to me. He gave me big beams, hand hewn out of hemlock, holding tractors, plows, and livestock for the women and men who work so hard. Just like big beams, ones you can depend on to bear the load and send on the courage and the strength to be big beams. I hope you can be a big beam for someone else.